I'm Jodie Rose and I make music with the sound of bridges. And what I do is I go to a bridge, such as the Golden Gate, which you can see next to me, and I gently place the contact microphone directly onto the cables, thus picking up the vibration from the bridge. And so for me this is a really beautiful moment, like when I tune in and listen to a bridge. Uh, it's always really exciting and it kind of takes, it takes you to a slightly different place, like it really just shifts something. And so you're already, you're standing on a bridge, you're kind of a little bit, you're between one side and another, you're looking out across the water, you have a different perspective, you're a little bit suspended, and it just is a really beautiful kind of transformative moment. For me it's like a symbol or a, a tuning into all the possibilities that there are in life. I often make a recording of this and then I go away and compose with it. And sometimes I've been lucky enough to make live events where I actually amplify the sound of the bridge right there on the bridge and I invite people to come and play and anyone walking by can enjoy this strange concert. So this was actually made for a commission by City Sonics and it was installed in a beautiful School of Architecture chapel in Mons in Belgium. And we had it suspended from the ceiling and against the chapel window. And then the sound is actually playing using contact speakers, quite a lot like the contact microphone, that are placed onto the bridge and they actually make the sound play through the object. will be the 10th anniversary of my first trip to record bridges and for this anniversary I would like to produce a beautiful singing bridge sculpture quite like the one you see behind me a new design it's based on the Novi Most in Bratislava which people often ask me what's your favorite bridge and in terms of bridges that is my all-time favorite bridge but the Novi Most is really special because you can get a lift up to the top and there's a circular UFO type thing at the top. So partly I like it because it looks like a UFO landed on it, and partly I like it because there's a bar in it. And you can go and have a drink in this bridge, and you're looking out on this beautiful 14th century castle on one side, up along the Danube. I'm really interested in connecting with a community of people who love bridges, or engineering, or architecture, or music, or sound, and just seeing if there's something interesting and exciting that they actually want to support the creation of this new bridge. Yeah.